Hi guys and welcome for my house sales. Hope you're having a blessed day so far. This is Sharon here once again with you just to share a quick floral arrangement DIY with you. So let's get started. So what I'll be using today is some floral of course. I have some flowers and I have some red hues on the ends. I have some pineapple flowers also. And I have these little yellow poppy flowers. I have some long grass. So these are going to be a centerpiece for my table and um, now getting it done. And I have some silver ribbon already cut to the size of the base. I have some biogel or water baby as it's known. I already soaked it so it's already to the clumped size. These come in little packets that, like I originally had said. And they are very tiny seeds and when you put them in water, they plump up to the size. And I have my these. This is tall and uh, it's about two feet in height. This was the original vase here and I had stuck this glass to it. So now I have a long cylinder vase. So all I'll be doing, and like I said, it's quick, is pouring the gel into the vase. Ensuring that none <laughs> pops out. And I see one is, has just escaped. Well, these are these biogels or water babies as, it, as it's normally called. This can be used in any function, any decor, christenings, baby showers, in your own home to make your table or center table or consoles look very elegant. So what I'll be doing is sticking the ribbon. This ribbon is silver and it has a little glitter on it. So I'll be sticking it to the vase at the bottom and at the top here. So let me just check my glue gun and see if it's heated. So I'll be sticking it to the top of the vase and to the bottom. Now this is very quick. Takes no time at all. And I'll place this one just at the bottom. And this is how it looks. So already it starts to look very elegant. I'll just be inserting my, my floral. Now my floral is very long, so um, you guys may not be able to see it. So the first piece I'll be putting in is this one. But of course I'll show you guys when I'm done. I'm also placing these pieces on either side. I'm going to use the grass and place it on the inside also. So this is what it starts to look like. So I'm just going to be arranging my floral how I would like to see them. And because the table is wrong, um, people is going to be seeing all sides so I'm ensuring that the sides also has a floral in it So this is what I have so far. So I'll just set this aside and I have another one to show you guys. So this is a piece of um, foam. This came in a long length, at least 45 inches long. 
and I cut it to the size that I want because this is going to be going around the vase that's going to be coming up from the center and I taped it off now it's not going to be showing so I would not bother covering it and I have some flowers here that I'm going to be using there are white and there are um, tinges of off-white and um, I'm using hydrangeas and also I have some sprigs that I will be using so to do this quick and easy arrangement I'm just going to be flanking these in first and I'm going to be placing three of them spiraling around the top so when I do put my flowers around it's going to be peeking out from the center of it now these going very easy to the foam you just adjust and of course if you don't like the positioning you can take out and reposition your floral where you want it these I will insert last and I'll just be putting placing my floral around the perimeter of the piece now I can do it on opposite sides, um, you know how it's normally done, but I'm just putting them in side by side. So this is what you start to get. So remember the center here is going to be, be remaining clear to accept the vase portion of it. And these things are so quick and easy, anybody can do it. already it starts to fill out because I have the plastic here it has to go through the plastic also so so I'm just inserting all the pieces in this is what I have going on so far so this is how it looks I'm just going to be placing these pieces following the same spiral shape now it's just two of these so I'll just be placing them eyeballing that and placing it and I'll just insert the other flowers at the top these will act as fillers for the piece so this is how it's looking Now you're in a rush, these things don't take any time at all. So you can put together a quick floral arrangement, your guests coming, you, you know, you're having your family over. Quick, quick, quick and easy pieces. And this is how it looks. So I'm just going to show you how it looks with the vase in the center. So I'm just placing the piece in the center making sure that everything sits nicely and I'm just going to be placing the base the center of that and arranging it how I would like to see it so this is how the piece looks and it's just centered under my pendant lighting and it turned out pretty easy and this is what you can do in under 10 minutes so guys nice being with you again Sharon here from my house sales wishing all mothers and fathers who are being um, taken the role of being a mother um, wishing you all God's blessings and you know enjoy your mother's day stay blessed and catch you later